Now to our border report. This morning we're live in Naco, Arizona, about two hours south of Tucson. That's where we find our Allie Bradley. Allie, uh, you have some new video that you'll only see that we'll only be able to show our viewers here on News Nation. Yeah, Adrian, you're exactly right. And a scene that you're only going to see right here on News Nation as well. When we first arrived, we were driving along the border barrier here, which obviously has this C wire, this Constantina wire. But we're going to show you. Look up here. This is actually a guide right now, right in front of us, talking with migrants who have already crossed over. And you can see that he has a rope hanging down below him as well. There's another guide on the ground. You can kind of see, uh, Bartley, if we can kind of zoom in a little bit here, we've got a guy down here as well. On the ground using a cell phone. So, right now they're communicating with the people that they've already crossed over. You can see as we get a little bit closer, you can see right here they actually have a ladder that he is using right now to go up to the top. You can see the, la the, the rope that they're using to lower them down. But let me show you this video here. When we first got here, about three or four men ran into the bushes. And so, when we first stopped, we didn't really think that they were going to communicate with us at all, but they were pretty brazen. They didn't really care that we were here. So, we started communicating with them. I asked them if they had more migrants over there. They said yes. They started just sending them over one by one. You can see them literally being lowered down from the rope. You can see this guy over here. Uh, if you guys want to come back out here live for us here, tienes más migrantes por allá? No más, no más. So he's telling me there's no more uh, immigrants over on the other side. When we did talk with some of the migrants, though, that were over here, they said that they were from Mexico. And that's something that Border Patrol also told us with these gotaways, these runners that we're seeing out here in NACO, that the majority of them are from Mexico and they know they're going to be returned under Title 42, that immediate expulsion. So they're running, but there is a criminal element as well in the Tucson sector. They have seen a 40% increase in criminal uh, arrests as well with their migrants, where they're seeing over 2,300 migrants who had criminal history that have been apprehended. And DHS confirms to me, Adrian, that we have seen more than 570,000 gotaways. But again, right now they're helping them on the cell phones. They both have cell phones. We've seen the guys run into the bushes out into the brush and what they're doing is they're guiding them. We did see one border patrol vehicle uh, drive by. However, there's no border patrol to be found. These guys have run off. As far as we know, they haven't been caught and they likely won't be caught. And again, those are going to contribute to the more than 570,000 gotaways now that we've already seen this fiscal year since October 1st, Adrian. All right, Ali, thank you to you and thank you for providing that exclusive video. Uh, we have more break. Thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.